situation for us today. Storm system will be through right now. It's cold front is generating some showers behind that. Another couple of hours, we're really gonna have to deal with some pretty raw winds. Uh, here's precision radar. Uh, the activity now moving through uh, primarily confined from Rochester to the east. Right now we see some heavier enhancement to that rain right around uh, Rolling Stone, Altura and St. Charles. That's pushing east with a little snow also maybe mixing in. So you expect a little bit of that first thing this morning. Then we get a break. We may even see some sunshine for parts of the morning hours. We're looking at the current observations. Rain showing up as uh, the, the primary uh, form of uh, activity right now. Rain and clouds, but to the west, actually reporting spots uh, are talking about some starlight. Eventually, maybe some sunshine for a time, but that will be only for a limited time. Here's a picture from Gary Heft yesterday. I had some happy d uh, ducks and geese out there in some of that sunshine, although we did lose some of the uh, sun late in the day. Clouds began to roll in ahead of the storm system. 36 right now in Rochester as we look outside with our Lewiston Auto camera. Uh, light rain falling. Temperatures now 30s to around 40. Very mild for this time of the year, certainly for early March standards. Average high this time of the year is 35. We're above that already in Rochester. Austin 41. It's 37 in Charles City. So 36, but here's one thing we'll have to consider today. The wind is going to get progressively stronger right now. It's not all that strong, but the wind chill is still uh, below the 30 degree mark. So 28, the current wind chill. And as winds pick up and temperatures basically remain stagnant in the mid and upper 30s, that wind chill index will actually be dropping. So a much colder feeling day. Rain moving through, some big gaps developing in the clouds behind this main rain band. But going into the midday and afternoon, here's what's headed our way on the backside of the system. Snow showers and a little bit of rain mixing in as well. That's coming in out of North Dakota. The wind driven activity because by that time, we will be in a wind advisory. 9 o'clock until 6 this evening. We have gusts potentially in that 45 mile per hour range. Rochester down toward Preston, Decorah. Everything to the west in that wind advisory with those rough winds um, impacting our day, making it feel a bit colder and we'll have wind driven showers moving through. Windy with showers today. High temperatures in the upper 30s. A quieter Friday. Tomorrow we get a break from the rain, the wind. Uh, temperatures very similar to what we'll have today, but it'll actually feel a lot better without that wind. In the weekend, a little breezier, but a whole lot warmer with the prospect of maybe getting close to 60 in that weather picture. But right now, we'll have to get uh, through this first. Rain moving through. We'll be done with this band of rain between 7 and 8 o'clock. We get a break. Then around 10, 30, 11 o'clock, a couple of sprinkles show up. We see a transition to some snow as the atmosphere will be, uh, will be dynamically cooled. In other words, some of that cold air aloft generating some snow. It falls through the atmosphere into a colder layer. And then we start seeing the change over to snow at times. So rain and snow showers both going on off and on throughout the midday and afternoon. Some raw winds to go with that. We'll have temperatures today only in the 30s. Again, wind chills in the 20s. And then this evening, the wind's still on the blustery side. The smaller pockets of snow showers until about 10 o'clock. And then things finally quiet down. So rain mainly this morning. By midday, rain and snow mixture, and by around 5 or 6 o'clock, just pockets of light snow, maybe just a little coating on the pavement for the evening commute, so keep that in mind. Not necessarily a lot. We're talking less than half an inch, but maybe make things a little slick. 37, some rain, gusty winds for the morning commute. Uh, right now it's 36 in Rochester, 41 in Waterloo. Behind the system, a little bit colder, 37 in Aberdeen, 32 in Morris this morning. A little gap in the in activity, maybe some sun for a few hours, but look at these winds, though. 25 miles per hour gusting to 40, rain and snow showers hours going to the afternoon and a blustery cold day 38 the high temperature in the middle part of the day future cast storm system generating all that wind and the snow and rain showers that uh, produces activity into the evening winds finally subside well after midnight skies will clear off we'll have some uh, cool sunshine tomorrow highs in the upper 30s but much lighter winds and then behind that temperatures st remain steady around the freezing mark tomorrow night and here comes a warm front that will draw in some much warmer air and some gusty winds that with some bright sunshine makes for a really warm and quiet weekend, well dry weekend anyway, rain possible Monday behind that system and then maybe a little snow next Tuesday. So a big warm up for a few days and then otherwise seasonably cool next week 30s to around 40. Uh, today at 38 in Rochester, 40 in Mason City, rain and snow showers, windy and colder gusts to 45 miles per hour. Uh, tonight uh, still blustery, a couple of snow showers until about 9 or 10 o'clock, then clearing late, a low of 22. Seven day forecast looking at a cool sunshine tomorrow, then a very mild weekend. Temperatures uh, about 20 degrees above average. And then next week, a little rain, and then maybe just a little coating of snow next Tuesday uh, early in the day. Wow, the weekend is really something, isn't it's it? It's standing out way better than all the days surrounding it. Certainly better than today. We'll just have to get through uh, our Thursday and uh, may need a, a poncho. We know improvements around. coming. We'll be okay. Thanks.